What's up, YouTube Nation? We are back today on uh, the next couple episodes, actually, are going to be very special. We're here on Sardis Lake in uh, Mississippi. Uh, so come along for the ride. We're going to have a fantastic time. We're going to put big fish in the boat. We've got the Savage 13s. I got my partner, Mike Geiger, with me. And uh, we're going to put some slabs in the boat and have a ball doing it. So this lake is extremely low right now. I'll show you that here shortly, but uh, we're going to put a we're gonna put a bunch of fish in the boat with a Savage 13, do a bunch of, you know, tournament style jigging and uh, just have a ball doing it. So stick with me, here we go. Where are we at, Mikey? We are on Sardis Lake. The lake looks a little bit lower than normal for this time of year, but we're going to go out and put some slabs in the boat. Like he he got the shape. Got him. That's a freaking. Oh, well, well. That's a big fish. Look at the size of this fish, guys. Unbelievable. Go ahead. Unbelievable. We're gonna weigh that. Yeah, my scale's right there. Oh. On the side of my bag. Two thirty-one. Two thirty-one. <laughs> First fish on the 15 foot Savage. Monster. All right guys, just a uh, kind of a quick walk through of the Savage 13. We've done it several, we've done it a couple times now, but um, Savage 13. It's first and foremost, a 13 foot rod. Mid seat, extremely long back end here to give you the leverage you need with your, your arms, regardless of the size, who, how, how tall you are. Um, but you can transfer, transform this rod on the fly as we have done today, me and Mike, both changed from the 13 to the 15. We just simply added the midsection right here, and now we've got a 15 footer. We can do the same thing, and I'm, I'm sure we'll do that while we're here in Sardis, is go to a 16 foot. Um, but what a what a treat to be able to adjust on the fly when you're in on a lake like this um, Again first and foremost It's a 13 footer savage 13 available at three pound fishing.com, but it can be Transformed on the fly to another size rod, which is awesome. So back at it Woo. Beautiful There you go. Got him. What do you got there, Mike? Crappie. That's a beautiful crappie. Oh, guy. They look good on the monitor, though. Anytime you expand this down to 10, like we're at now, these fish look like they're monsters. Good fish there, Mike. <clears throat> nice little Sardis fish on the new Savage 13 by Three Pound Fishing. That's awesome, man. Good fish. Fishing there. Oh, 
All right. So we're sitting back here behind the marina now. We've had to hide from the, the wind. And uh, we're just taking what we can get, really. They're not bad fish, it looks like. We've been dropping on some good ones. See this guy right here, the dirt. Slavers 13, get some slavers in the boat. All right, so what we're, uh, we've been playing with a lot of baits today because the bite is definitely a little bit more finicky than we would like. We don't know if that's because of the wind and the motor, that we're, the, the noise we're creating, but um, we have tried plastics, larger and small hair jigs, and have definitely mixed up with the colors. And it, right now I'm just playing with kind of a clown looking bait that seems to be doing okay uh they're certainly not jumping all over it but um temperatures rising we're roughly around 60 degrees now and uh sardis the one thing i will say is that um anytime you have a south southwest wind this this lake gets hit pretty hard so you have to watch that um, you're really looking for either a i believe an east wind or no wind low wind so just know that before you come here all right, guys, I think we're going to end it here, but look at this, how low the water is. You've got those stake beds right there. You can kind of see it right there. Uh, water is incredibly low, lower than uh, we've ever seen it. And Mike's been here more than I have, and he says it's the lowest it's the lowest he's ever seen. Uh, really a great fish at 231 to start the day off, but at the end of that, after that, it, it's been pretty much, you know, solid eater size fish, but nothing spectacular. And the wind really got in our way for sure today. But uh, the Savage, you know, performed flawlessly. It was awesome. Um, it was a lot of fun. So we're going to be back here uh, for the next couple of extra episodes. So tomorrow is supposed to be no wind, and we're looking forward to it. So please subscribe and share the video. Appreciate you guys. And don't forget, I am going live a ton on TikTok, and I'm sure tomorrow we will be going live as well um, on TikTok. So please uh, watch that if you would. Have a great one, guys. Hey, guys, Matt for 3 Pound Fishing. Hey, check out this stud, 238, caught on the Savage 13, a rod that is meant to be a 13, but also can be transformed into a 15 or a 16 footer on the fly. And we did that today on Sardis. The Savage 13, you can, it's available at www.3poundfishing.com. Take it easy, guys.